In the world of boxing, one name reigns supreme with sheer power and intensity. Mike Tyson, the ultimate knockout king. Get ready to experience the sheer force of Tyson's punches as we delve into his top 10 most jaw-dropping knockouts. Tyson's dominance in the ring was unmatched. His punches weren't just hits. They were like earthquakes, leaving opponents shattered in their wake. But just when you think Tyson's story has reached its peak, a new chapter unfolds. He's gearing up to face off against the bold and brash Jake Paul. Can Tyson's unmatched skill and unwavering determination overcome this new challenge? Join us as we witness the clash of past and present, with Tyson gearing up to unleash his fury once again. The countdown to chaos has officially begun. Don't miss out, because the legend of Iron Mike Tyson is far from finished. 10. Larry Holmes, January 1988 In 1988, boxing fans witnessed a clash between two legends, Mike Tyson and Larry Holmes. It was a battle that showcased the passing of the torch from one generation to the next. Tyson, the young and ferocious champion, faced off against Holmes, a seasoned veteran known for his tactical prowess and iron chin. From the opening bell, Tyson asserted his dominance, unleashing a barrage of power punches that had Holmes on the defensive. But Holmes, tough as they come, endured Tyson's fierce attack through sheer determination and know-how. However, Tyson's relentless pressure proved too much for Holmes to handle. In the fourth round, Tyson landed a thunderous combination that sent Holmes crashing to the canvas. He should be hanging on. Now with the right hand, the left hand. He's gonna hang on, and he'll stop the fight. Down he goes. Now he's hurt. It's all over. It was a defining moment in Tyson's career as he demonstrated his ability to overpower even the most seasoned opponents. In just four rounds, Mike Tyson had solidified his status as one of the greatest heavyweight champions of all time, leaving Larry Holmes in awe of his raw power and skill. 9. Alfonso Ratliff, 1986 In this electrifying bout from 1986, Iron Mike Tyson faced off against Alfonso Ratliff in what would become one of Tyson's most memorable victories. From the opening bell, Tyson unleashed his trademark aggression, relentlessly pursuing Ratliff with his lightning-fast combinations and bone-crushing power. Despite Ratliff's best efforts to weather the storm, Tyson's onslaught proved too much to handle. In a display of sheer dominance, Tyson secured the victory with a knockout in the second round, solidifying his reputation as one of the most formidable heavyweights of all time. And that's why the Tyson vs. Ratliff fight earns its place as one of the top knockouts in Iron Mike's legendary career. Eight, Marvis Frazier, 1986. In this fight between Mike Tyson and Marvis Frazier, Tyson's raw power was on full display. Frazier, son of the legendary Joe Frazier, was known for his speed and agility, but he couldn't handle Tyson's relentless aggression. Tyson's punches were like sledgehammers, pounding Frazier again and again. And then in a blink of an eye, Tyson delivered a devastating blow that sent Frazier crashing to the canvas. It was over before Frazier knew what hit him. Another victory for the unstoppable force that was Mike Tyson. Seven, Clifford Etienne, 2003. The match was crucial for Tyson as he aimed to reestablish himself in the heavyweight division following his previous loss to Lennox Lewis. The bell rings and Tyson charges like a bull. He lands a thunderous right hand that sends Etienne straight to the canvas, just 49 seconds into the first round. Etienne tries to get up, but he's all wobbly. Referee counts him out, and boom, it's over. Tyson wins in lightning speed, proving once again why he's one of the greatest knockout artists in boxing history. Six, Carl Williams, 1989. The match was billed as a significant challenge for Tyson because Carl Williams was known for his strong jab and solid skill set. However, 93 seconds into the first round, Tyson unleashed a powerful left hook that sent Williams crashing to the canvas. The referee stopped the fight and declared Tyson the winner by knockout.
5. Pinklin Thomas, 1987. Tyson was defending his WBA and WBC titles against former WBC champion Pinklon Thomas, renowned for his powerful right hand. Tyson, the young powerhouse, wasted no time. He came out swinging, relentless as always. Thomas tried to hold his ground, but Tyson's power was just too much. Boom! A ferocious uppercut from Tyson sent Thomas crashing to the canvas. He tried to get up, but it was all over. The ref waved it off. Another stunning knockout for Iron Mike. That's why they call him the baddest man on the planet. 4. Frank Bruno, 1989. Tyson fought to defend his undisputed heavyweight title against British challenger Frank Bruno. Though Bruno managed to surprise Tyson with a strong left hook initially, he eventually couldn't withstand Tyson's aggression. The contest ended when the referee intervened after a barrage of powerful combos from Tyson. Tyson knows he's got him in big trouble. If he doesn't answer it, Richard Steele has moved in. Resulting in Tyson winning via technical knockout. 3. Tyrell Biggs, 1987. In the legendary bout of 1987, Mike Tyson squared off against Tyrell Biggs in a clash of giants. Biggs utilized his reach advantage early on, but Tyson's relentless power proved too much. With each punishing blow, Tyson dominated the ring, leaving no doubt about his unmatched prowess. In the end, Tyson emerged victorious, solidifying his status as one of the greatest heavyweight champions in history. 2. Donovan Ruddock, 1991. In the match between Mike Tyson and Donovan Ruddock, Anticipation peaked as the fight reached its climax in a single decisive moment. As the fight got more intense, Tyson's aggressive attacks made it hard for Ruddick to defend himself. In a pivotal moment, Tyson delivered a devastating combination that sent Ruddick crashing to the canvas. The referee intervened, calling an end to the fight and declaring Tyson the winner by knockout. 1. Michael Spinks, 1988 when Mike Tyson stepped into the ring against Michael Spinks in Atlantic City, it was a clash of titans. Tyson wasted no time, delivering a series of powerful blows that left Spinks stunned. In just 91 seconds, Tyson landed a decisive uppercut, knocking Spinks out cold. It was a swift and brutal victory, solidifying Tyson's reputation as one of the greatest boxers of all time. As we've relived Mike Tyson's electrifying top 10 knockouts, it's clear why he's left an indelible mark on the world of boxing. But now the legend is gearing up for a new challenge as he prepares to step back into the ring against none other than Jake Paul. As the excitement builds, Jake Paul and Mike Tyson are set to face off in an exhibition boxing match at AT&T Stadium in Arlington, Texas on July 20th. This unique crossover event will be streamed globally by Netflix, making it accessible to millions of households. Jake Paul, the social media star turned boxer, boasts a nine to one record with six knockouts. He's determined to prove himself in the boxing world and defeating Tyson would be a significant milestone. Mike Tyson, the former undisputed world heavyweight champion has a legendary career spanning two decades. Although he's 57 years old and hasn't boxed publicly since 2020, his power remains a force to be reckoned with. Tyson's experience and reputation make him a formidable opponent, even against a younger adversary like Paul. So mark your calendars for July 20th, as these two fighters collide in what some are calling the biggest fight of the 21st century. It's a clash of generations, styles, and legends, and the world will be watching.